Bianca and Alex, you are our singers for Eurovision 2015. What was it like making that video? Amazing. So much fun and, and very surreal as well. Yeah, <laughs> incredibly mind-blowing. And we've been working with some fantastic dancers and choreographers and all the people behind the cameras and the creative team have been incredible. So it's been fantastic, yeah. Who wrote the song? A guy called David Mendel and um, Adrian Bax White, who we both know and really talented songwriters. Because you don't normally sing together, do you? We've never done anything live. We were working on some original music yeah. um, together, but um, we, we've known David for a little while and he chose us to do this song. And, you know, the moment I heard it, I thought, absolutely, I'm singing on that. So how did you get to, to here today? How did you get to be our entry for this year? There was a open, open submission, submission yeah. yeah, so whereby the public could actually enter a song, as long as they had a video to go with it, and um, we got there. Yeah. <laughs> you know. Did you ever think when you were entering it that you, you would get to this point where you'd be representing your country? <laughs> We've always had faith in the song. It's so fun and so catchy. But yeah, it's still very sort of, we are still pinching ourselves that we're here today. So Bianchi, I know that you were on The Voice last year. I was, yeah. But they didn't turn round. They didn't, know. More for picked... them. <laughs> yeah. yeah, thank you. I think I went with the wrong song. Um, but yeah, the, like, everyone there was so nice and like the crowd were amazing. Mm. And it actually sort of made me realise, oh God, I, I love performing live to a big crowd. And I came off and I was like, I want to do that again. So yeah, it was, it was a good experience. And Alex, what's your background? Well, uh, singer-songwriter, more recently for the last seven years, I've been pretending to be Mick Jagger in a Rolling Stones tribute band. That's incredible. What are they called? The Rolling Clones. Right. What attracted you to the song? It's so catchy. Got, yeah, you've got the catchiness and you've got this fusion of the 1920s and 1930s, that kind of vibe, brought up to date with modern beats and... Yeah, bass. it's electro swing, which is a really popular genre at the moment. Yeah, it's growing, um, growing it's a lot. It's getting really big and it's something I've always been into, so when David said, are you up for doing an electro swing song, I was like... Yeah. As soon as you hear the start of it, you think, well, yeah, yeah I'd love to sing on that. It's such a fun Why song. Not? Alex, there's a bit in the song where you kind of just go freestyle and yeah. do a bit of scatting. <laughs> all made up on the spot? Yeah, I just went for it and, and did it. Actually, the scat thing is, is something I've always been into because I love Louis Armstrong and then later on Tom Waits and it was all that kind of gravelly voice kind of thing. So, yeah, it felt right for that song, the right time era, so I put it on. Can you tell us the actual words for people that didn't catch it? Yeah, uh, skiddly bee bop, diddy bop, diddy bop, diddy doo. Awesome, thanks for clearing that up. No problem at all. How hard has it been to keep it from your friends and family? Because I, I reckon that must be the hardest <laughs> thing to do. A nightmare. Is it? Yeah. Just really, really hard, just coming up with all these reasons why I'm sort of out all day for the last few weeks. I think they've figured it out, though. Just yeah, I now. think they might know now. Yeah. <laughs> they do right now. I think we might be in a bit of trouble, but, yeah, yeah it's just been incredibly hard. So what have you been saying to them? <laughs> I, well, they saying. know that we entered, right. so sort of, I'll oh, mock rehearsals in case we get it. Um, yeah. we're, we're shortlisted, but we don't know. And... Well, we won't know to the last minute whether we, you know, there's still another group in contention yeah. and all that okay. kind of stuff. So, yeah. it's been... so you've been keeping it quite vague. Yeah, yeah, very vague. Purposely so. What do you think they'll say when they know? Hopefully, Hopefully they'll forgive us. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully they'll be incredibly proud. They will be, or we'll be in a yeah. lot of trouble. I'm sure it's one or the other at the <laughs> no, moment. No, they'll definitely be proud. Definitely be yeah. proud, yeah. So there's quite a few dancers in the video, as we just saw, but obviously Eurovision rules are only six people on stage, including yourselves. So how will you recreate what we just saw on the big night? There's a huge team um, behind it. Working uh, really hard. Working really hard, and they've got something very, very special. So it won't yeah. be a recreation, We're but it's going to be mind-blowing nonetheless. Gonna have to up our game. If I said to you both that a year ago you would be representing the UK in Vienna at the Eurovision Song Contest, the biggest singing contest in the world, what would you say? I think the fact that you're talking to me right now is crazy enough. <laughs> I, I, I wouldn't have believed it for a second. It's, no, you know, it's, neither. It's just been a whirlwind. The last few months yeah. has just gone in the blink of an eye and suddenly we're here with dancers swirling round and ultraviolet lights and all sorts of things. Now, interestingly, the UK's first duet at Eurovision in 1959 came second, 
But then there was the Gemini incident where there mm -hmm. was, yeah. obviously there was no point. So how do you feel at the moment? Is the glass half empty or, or half full? Um, well, I think it'll be third time lucky. <laughs> Good answer. <laughs> Absolutely. We want to make the country proud. We hope they get behind us. And, yeah. um, you know, we're going to pull out all the stops to try and wow them as best yeah. as we can. We're just going to try our best. As soon as you hear that hook of the song, it's in your head. Yeah. Done, yeah. The best of luck to both of you. We love the song. And thank you, Bianca and Alex. We will see you in Vienna. Thank you very yeah. much. Thank see you, you there. Don't drink too much wine, just one